Hello and welcome. The buildings here at the Troy Historic Village are more than artifacts. They each tell a part of the story of this community. To hear about the stories, play the short videos next to the image of the building you've entered. I suggest you begin in the log cabin. Mm -hmm. Then, if you have time and you would like to learn a little bit more, just scroll down and read more about the story before moving on to your next stop. We'll also suggest things to read or examine at each stop. But before you go, let me tell you a little bit about the story related to this room. Before Troy became a city in 1955, it was governed as a township, and this building was the township hall where residents voted, paid taxes, and attended meetings. This was also the police department, and there's still an old jail cell in the basement. Morris Waddles, who supervised the construction of this building in 1927, was so determined to make sure this room was included as a tribute to pioneers like his grandparents that cleared virgin forests, planted crops, and carved a community out of the wilderness. Now, look up. These beams are from Troy's oldest farms. Now, look into the fireplace. Those metal arms, or crane with kettle, came from Pioneer Johnson Niles Inn. This hearth is huge, like one you see in his old inn, where lots of food was prepared for travelers. <laughs> 